the superhero movie to end all superhero movies, hopefully. Well, you kind of did that with Justice League movie, and now with this... Oh, God, no! No! Interruptions. No, I just had break now, and I saw that, and not a good idea. I went that, and I had in the cafeteria nice chicken and biscuit with a nice gravy, and it was. <clears throat> Problem was that it had corn in there. I'm not practically allowed to eat corn, so there's a good chance that my stomach may be playing up for the next couple of days for my weekend. But it was really good food, I will say. Been a quiet day in work. Just been well. I had the new supervisor down here as well. We've been sorting out a couple of things, re tidying up the place as you can see, just moving stuff around. But uh, oh my god, like as well. That um, that was another tweet that I read today. I know I can't get up because my oh, really, Jinx Monsoon, the voice is a villain for Steven Universe. Nice. Sorry. Uh, I read an open letter that came from YouTube about half an hour ago in which I, well they only put like a certain amount in because the rest of it I can't see because, uh, you know what, I'm low on data, the data's all gone, I'll just tap to retry and get it up that way. There was an open letter to the community for YouTube by YouTube in regards to what happened last week uh, because there's been a lack of communication when it was a shitstorm with a Logan Paul scenario. So, allow me for a few seconds of your time to read out this open letter that we just received from YouTube. Uh, like many others, we were upset by the video that was shared last week. Suicide is not a joke, nor should it ever be a driving force for views. As Anna Akana put it perfectly, that body was a person someone loved. You do not walk into a suicide forest with a camera and claim mental health awareness. No. We expect more of the creators who build their community on YouTube, and we're sure you do too. The channel violated our community guidelines, we acted accordingly, and we are looking at further consequences. It's taken us a long time to respond, but we've been listening to everything you've been saying. We know that the actions of one creator can affect the entire community, so we'll have more to share soon on steps we're taking to ensure a video like this is never circulated again. Uh, basically, it took them a while just to take that video down and from watching last week of Tomska's it was that 600,000 people not only viewed but liked that video as well and it took them that long just to take that video down I mean honestly you know fair enough YouTube is doing its best to get on creativity and for censorship and for the guidelines as well as having a team work on what product should be going out there but I still go back to the creator himself in which honestly he put up an apology video where it's like oh, I'm sorry I put it up I shouldn't have done that and uh, I wasn't thinking or anything yeah that's the thing dude you weren't thinking and to be honest common sense being you shouldn't have fucking done it. Literally should not have done it. As soon as you see it, you even filming, you know, you could have been like, oh God, that is happening over there. Turn the camera off and stop. All right, you don't bring it up in your vlogs. You don't bring it up in anything like that whatsoever. I mean, honestly, that whole day with the video, you shouldn't have even, you should have just stopped there and not even uploaded that, to be honest. But uh, what's done is done. But the thing is, you know, I see that in some of the community when we talk about this certain particular person, you know, and we know that what he's done is wrong, there are still people out there in the community that even his views or his viewers are still like, ah, oh, you know, it was a mistake, you know, it does happen, accidents were made, we still support and love you. And that, and I'm green with. Tom Scout here, and when I say that's a scary thing, that really is a scary thing where it's like, and the, 
the problem is, he's, this is not the first time he has done something this stupid. And there were other vigils as well. I mean, there was one vigil that was brought up where it's like, you know, that's not the only time in Japan in which he has shown such disrespect and everything. And there he is, running around, throwing squids on taxi roofs and onto roads, running around like that, acting so disrespectful to a beautiful culture that is Japan. And... We have this tool coming around that's making a mockery, disrespecting the culture, and uh, we're not like that. We are bloody not like that as vloggers and such, no. No, we respect cultures and everywhere in between. It, that, that sucked. Plus as well, there was, yeah, another video where he was waving to his fans from a hotel room, and he pulled off a stunt where... There in his hotel room, in the window, he blows his brains out, and there's blood on the window, and he collapses, and all of his viewers are laughing from the street, thinking, ah, maybe he's joking, maybe he's not, and it's like, where have we come now to a time where that sort of thing is okay, where we see blood and gore from viewers just, just to get views? I mean, fair enough, okay, Game of Thrones, but still, in a YouTube community, you got these fans and viewers in which are watching you, you know, and you're showing, you know, you should be showing them love and respect and not playing these pranks and stuff where it's like, oh, hey, I'm going to wave, and then all of a sudden I'll blow my brains out, you know, as a joke. That's going to affect people, and that, no, no, fuck off, no. That shouldn't be done overall, you know. But yeah, fair enough. YouTube is taking action. Most probably they'll know him then because he brings in the views and the revenue. And they put him in YouTube red shit in which, to be honest, not really that good. Like his brother as well. But it's basically... They should not let him continue with his videos on YouTube. He broke the guidelines, fair enough. But they shouldn't let him go off with a light heart of warning. You know, even if he tries to apologise, they shouldn't let him continue on. And honestly, I think... It's up for him. I can see that his fame is going to be up. And, you know... He shouldn't have done it. He shouldn't have fucking done it. And... If he gets away... You know, with a slap in the wrist to say, oh, don't do that again, then it kind of goes to show then what the system of YouTube is like now when it comes to their you know, YouTubers and such and what they want to try and do to gain more money. <sighs> I don't know. Anyway, back to work for me. Yay. 1.30 in the morning on a Friday night for me. Well, it's not like Friday as in like the calendar day Friday, but my Friday from work, but I don't give a crap. <laughs> and, oh, God. Just been relaxing. I mean, McDonald's was freaking nice. And then sorting out a couple of things. And I know that with my weekend tomorrow, it's going to be easy peasy relax and do a stream. Uh, that's the thing. Chris is not feeling too well, so I don't know if with one, well, the time I stream, if he would want to use the sofa just to curl up and just fall asleep and flop around on, or if he would be still in bed and such. So I'll have to play by ear to see how it goes tomorrow. And definitely in the morning, uh, me and Chris need to go and sort out one or two things because, uh, well, actually, I'm not, I'm not going to say exactly what happened. It's only because, at this point, I feel it's like a little bit too soon to talk about. It's nothing bad, nothing too bad, don't worry. Just need to sort some things out. And basically, I had a bit of a situation, not a bad one, not totally bad, but a little bit of a situation. And now tomorrow we have to go and sort it out. And it's going to be interesting. That's why I'm going to get some things together so at least then I know what I'll need to do 
what will he will need to do and such, then see what we can do. Why do I feel like... Hold on. I'm not surprised this battery, again, is freaking... Stop it! Battery! I charged you the other day. I get it. You are dying. I will... <sighs> Just stop. So anyway, I'm going to call it a night, try and get some sleep if I can. But tomorrow should be interesting, I will say. Hopefully. See how I feel. But thank you guys for watching today's video. Hopefully you have enjoyed the little rant I had about YouTube. As always, <laughs> if you have, don't forget to like and subscribe. And we shall see you tomorrow for a brand spanking new day. And hopefully it will be a little bit better than the rest. So until then, take it easy, guys. Nostar.